All right, moving Z spheres in a different manner. Now, as you can see throughout the series, I had a little bit of issues moving some stuff. Uh, they would do some wacky things, like if I move these, all of their counterparts would move like that. Okay, so this that was very suspicious. So what I wanted to do is do some research into the fact that you know this is a little different. Other than that, Z spheres, you know, rock. And the story is, if you hold Alt and Command, you can now move these in groups. You can also scale them in groups. So notice how I can I can upscale the entire arm that way. Okay. Now where it stops, I'm not quite sure how it develops or uh, as far as the scale goes. You know, how does it know when to stop? If I if I scale up here, it stops at the elbow. So you can see these white bones occur, and that indicates where the chain is going to end at the scale. If I go here, notice that the chain is going all the way up. So there's a few new tricks to these spheres, and no doubt that is a very, very nifty trick. Um, again, you know, with ZBrush, it's one of the things is that's things that you have to kind of develop and learn along the way. Um, sometimes they put it in books, sometimes they don't. Uh, and most of the time it takes a little bit of effort on your part to just kind of play around with the system until you actually figure it out. So there's the new move. Hope you enjoy. And now let's go into the next video.